Uh, people might expect someone cool. But behind this mask, you'll find this naive virgin still in his adolescence. Only a middle-aged man would understand it. If you were still a kid, you'd think, ah, so this is cool. If you're young, you'd look up to this kind of a man. But when you're already middle-aged, you kind of understand his feelings, not being able to lay a finger on a girl and wondering if you're a coward. In manga such as Shonen Weekly Jump magazines, Yuna and the Haunted Hot Springs, We Can't Study, and Young Magazine's What Is the Teacher Doing Here? The horny virgin cannot act even when he gets his chance. So the middle-aged men Miyazaki targets are exactly the same as these horny virgins caught up in their erotic fantasies. Like I said, Porco Rosso is an anime film for worn-out middle-aged men whose brain cells have turned into tofu. So, Miyazaki was supposed to do a favor by making this film for the average middle-aged men who are looking forward to reading an erotic article of a tabloid newspaper on a commuting train during the rush hour, whether they feel ashamed or not. So, these young nerds and Miyazaki are both delusional virgin types, and they share the same habits, but Miyazaki is a bit more dexterous, and he knows how to hide this side of him from girls. So, we move on to the next scene. While Porco is going, <laughs> lost in his own fantasies, the air pirates are working hard. This is the scene where we find out who the female students really are. Double Haze lands on the water. Double Haze is the name of Mama Yuto's seaplane. Double Haze smashes into the water when they make a splashdown. Like, boom! Is there a model of a seaplane? Oh, there it is. I hope it doesn't break. We don't have the exact model of Dabohaze, so we'll use one with a similar shape. So you see, instead of landing quietly like this, Dabohaze smashes on the surface of the water like this. Splash! It is said that the German seaplane called Dornier was the model of Dabohaze. And this Dornier is, I think, a DOJ type. Two engines in front and back. And the wing-like extension, called Sponson, is similar to that of a Dornier. Some people say it's a giant version of a Dornier, but Mama Yuto couldn't have afforded that. I think they modified the neck and made it look like an airship. It has been modified in so many ways that it's hard to imagine the original shape. This sponson under the main wing is the major feature. Sponson is like, so... It's like a short wing with a float that balances the ship when it lands on the water. Mama Yuto always makes a dramatic splashdown by creating a dynamic splash because the sponson causes a ground effect near the water surface. It's called the ground effect. So, for example, the plane's floating power temporarily spikes near the surface. Have you ever seen the human bird contest in Biwa Lake? The people in the gliding category fly right above the water surface. They intentionally maintain low altitude so that they can utilize the ground effect. If you fly about a meter above the water surface, a drone of that size that you see in Biwa Lake, oh sorry, not a drone, a glider, can easily fly by using the ground effect. If they fly 5 meters or 10 meters above the sea level, they'd lose the ground effect and lose the floating power. Since Dabohaze's sponson is too big, 
it generates too much lift. If you have a sponson right close to the water surface, just like this biplane here, it causes the ground effect. So, seaplanes or any biplanes with the wings at the bottom are extremely difficult to land because it causes the ground effect as it gets near the surface. It keeps flying and won't land. There have been many cases where planes lost speed and stalled. So, it's always better to smash into the water surface when you land. During World War II, when planes landed on carriers, they didn't land from the side. Instead, they came down from above and almost dropped on the deck. That was another way to avoid the ground effect. So, this type of plane was difficult to land. It tended to float and land further ahead due to the ground effect. So, the pilots intentionally dropped the plane on the water. Mama Yuto might have tried to utilize the resistance from the water to stop right in front of the ship. As you can see, Mama Yuto is busy working. 